What's going on you guys? Um, welcome to the How Do I channel. Today what I'm going to show you how to make is I'm going to show you how to make, uh, well, I'm making chicken, um, chicken legs in particular. And this process works with chicken legs, it works with wings, it works with ribs. <clears throat> it's going to leave a, uh, a delicious taste in your mouth, believe me. So what I did was I laid, uh, laid the chicken legs out. Um, and you want a deep pan, about like this, uh, maybe a little bit deeper. Uh, the reason why, I'll, t I'll get to that in a second. But I've laid them out. I put a little bit of water um, in the pan. A couple, uh, probably a couple teaspoons of butter. Um, sprinkle a little bit of brown sugar in it. And I use the, uh, this right here. This actually comes in a box. There's two of them in a box. Um, it's called, you can see it. It's called KC Masterpiece Original Barbecue Sauce Mix and Dry Rub. Delicious if you just lightly sprinkle it on top of that, on top of the the chicken or the um, the ribs that you're cooking. So I've got mine prepared. I've got it nicely uh, nicely rubbed down. I've got my water in there. I've got butter, and I sprinkle two teaspoons of brown sugar in there. It gives it a uh, little bit of a sweet taste, which it tastes really good. You'd have to try it. It tastes amazing. So what we're going to do now is um, we're going to, uh, well, give me just a second here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put some aluminum foil over top of it. Now, I'll make sure I get a pretty good seal with this aluminum foil around the top. The reason being for that, and the reason why we add butter and water, is because we are when I cook this, or when I cook this, I'm probably going to cook this for somewhere between two to three hours. Um, I'm going to slow cook it, and it's going to steam it, and it's going to be tender, delicious, and juicy. Very juicy. Um, when I'm done with this, I'm probably going to fire up the smoker, put it on uh, the smoker for probably about 45 minutes or so, and it'll give it a light smoke taste, which is absolutely delicious. I would definitely recommend everyone to try this, especially if you like barbecue. You're going to love this dish. You don't have to smoke it, but that's just a added option that I put or that I that I do. Thanks for watching this video. Um, if you like this video, you want to see more, like and subscribe.